Hello everyone, let me walk you through the demo of Odoo Excel Connector in Odoo by Browseinfo. This is a powerful tool that links your Odoo database directly with Microsoft Excel. It enables user to generate EOC Office Excel connection files allowing them to create dynamic real-time Excel report without manual data export or import. This streamlined reporting and boosts productivity by keeping data always up to date. Now. Here you can see an invoicing module, go into that, under customers you will find a menu for invoicing. Open that and here you can see all the invoices. Now select some invoices, I will be selecting the first four invoices. After that in action button, you will find a menu for create OEC template, click on that and a wizard will open to generate a link. Enter the name. I will be entering invoice. After that, you will find a domain under that. You can change your domain as you want from here. Now, after that, you can see the fields which will be generated in the Excel sheet. Here, from add line, you can add your fields. Here, you can see all the invoice related fields and you can select any one of them which you want to show in your Excel sheet. So I will be selecting date field to show in the Excel. Now after this, you can see a date field is added. Now here you will find a save button. As soon as you click on the save button, you can see a data URL will be generated. So from here, you can copy your data URL. Click on that and your data URL will be copied. Now open your Excel and in here you can see under sheet there is one menu for link to external data. Click on that and a wizard will open. Enter your URL here and after that you can click on enter. Now select automatic for your language of input and click on OK. Now here you can see all the invoice data which we have selected. Here you can see the number, the date, status, partner, total, user, created on and everything in here. Now we will again go into our Odoo interface and after this we will go into the sales module. Open that and in here you can see all the sale orders. Select some sale orders again. Here I have selected four different sale orders. Under action button you will find the menu for create OEC template. Click on that, enter name. I will be adding sale order as my name. Now here you can see the domain. Here you can add your field if you want from add line. Otherwise just click on save button. So now I will be clicking on save button. You can see a data URL is created. Now copy that data URL and again go to your Excel. Now here I will be going to my Excel and again under sheet we will find the menu for link to external data. Open that and enter your URL in here. This time enable the update every boolean as soon as you update uh, enable that you can see you can edit your seconds to update i have selected 60 seconds to my every update after this click enter click on ok and again click on ok here you can see your sale order Every sale order which we selected is showing here. You can see the customers, status, creation date, the salesperson, total and everything in here. Now here you will find the order reference, sale order number 3. You can see the order reference. You can see for sale order number 3, the status is draft. So. We will come to our Odoo interface and we will change the status of sale order number 3. You can see the sale order number 3. We will confirm it and it will be changed to sale order. Now, as I said, it will 
update on every 60 seconds so you can see the sale order number three is in draft state right now and if you check my system time it is 12.33 so we will wait for some time to change the time from 12.34 here you can see the sale order number 3 status has changed to sale as soon as your clock ticked 34 so here you can see it is changed now if you want to keep the log of everything you will go into the settings under user and company you can see the OEC records click on that and here you can see all the OEC records we created here you can open it and you can see everything in here even the generated URL you can find everything in here you can see the invoices one which we created and also the sale order one if you have any queries about this video, you can ask them in the comment box and we will solve your queries. If you feel this video is useful to you, please like, share and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more Odoo related videos. Thanks for watching.